That is not my neighbor. Should I let them in? Hello everybody, what is up? My name is Sam and welcome back to That's Not My Neighbor. In this game, our neighbors have been replaced by doppelgangers. And we must try to tell the difference between them because if we let too many doppelgangers in the building, they will kill everybody including us. And the last time I played this, I think I was pretty terrible and I made it quite far. So today we're gonna try to do even better. Let's do this. All right, yes, yes, yada, yada, yada. I know how to do my job. Welcome and congratulations on your new job. 346 minutes later. I wish you good luck. Thank you, bye. Alrighty, so the door is locked right now. I still have this clown thing, which is insane. I got this in the last one, hold on. I'll be right with you. Every night all over the world, hundreds of people see this clown in their dreams. If this clown appears in your dreams, don't play any games with him. If you want more information. So I think that's just another one of their games, but it's crazy that it knows that I played this before. Hey, buddy, it's you again. You guys gave me a couple tips in the comments last time. I'm hoping will keep me alive even longer. We got Angus Kipriani here. That is a long ID number. We're gonna go with the last four, eight, eight, four, five. We've got the DDD logo. It's got the three things on each side. And then it expires 1968. All right, so you're good for now. And this is his request. He's on floor one, room three. I'm a resident of the building. I come from my job as a businessman. And that also has the logo. Let's see if you're on the list. Angus Kipriani, all right. Floor one, room three. Over here, I've got my records. Hold on, sir, let me just look through here. All right, he's got a long neck, he wears a hat, he has a mustache, and he's got small beady eyes. Long neck, kind of, wears a hat, has a mustache, and small beady eyes. Yep, that's right, 8845. All right, all of this stuff appears to be in order. So we're just gonna go with a sure, come on in, buddy. So everything's in order, yep, you can keep going. Move along. And now I know I have to lock that. If you guys wanna see more of this game in the future, hit that like button and subscribe right now. Dude, could you back up a little bit? You're a little close. It's making me uncomfortable. All right, we got the DDD logo. It appears correct to me. Nine of 1965. All right, so that's in 10 years. He's good. Isaac Gauss, 2369. All right, Isaac Gauss, floor two, room two. And then floor two, room two. Isaac Gauss, his name is right. I'm a resident of the building. My apartment is the second on the second floor. Isaac Gauss, reporter. Appearance, big eyebrows, big smile, prominent chin, and big nose. Big eyebrows, prominent chin, big nose. Two, three, six, nine. All right, but the only thing I don't understand is they, they don't really give me a reason. Like, he's just like, I live here, but you didn't ask your job or anything. Let's question him on it. Why were you out of the building? My entry request? Yeah. I think everything is fine with my entry request. Is it? Is it? What the heck, what do I have to lose? Come on in, buddy. <laughs> so everything's in order? Sure, I don't even care anymore. Can you open the door for me? I know I'm gonna die. We're all gonna die, don't worry about it. All righty, who's up next? Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh! All right, I'll humor you for a minute. Anastasia McHillis. Oh, weird, you don't have a zipper on your face here. All right, question you. Mm, my face. <laughs> Yay, what's up with your face? Zipper, huh, isn't that weird? I don't know, job or whatever. Oh my gosh. I, um, I'll be with you in one moment, kind madam. Oh, I gotta call the day, day, day. One. Just hang tight right there, miss. Nothing is wrong. Cleaning protocol completed. You can continue your job. Thank you. Oh, you again? You were just here. Isaac Gauss, 65. All right, that is the correct logo as far as I'm aware. Unless they're all the wrong logo and I don't know what the logo is. All right, everything was the same as last time. I don't know what I'm doing wrong today, but just get in there. You don't have a zipper on your face. Hey, buddy. Good afternoon. What's going on? Alf Kupasin, uh, 6347. Looks like the official logo to me. 1960. All right, all that stuff is good. Alf Kapusin, uh, floor three, room four. I'm a resident. I come from my job as a lawyer. We got good old Alf on the list. 6347. He's a lawyer. He's got a big nose, a prominent mustache. Wears a monocle, wears a hat, and a round face. Wears a hat? 
You don't have a hat on. Uh, wear, <laughs> you can't not wear a hat if you're gonna say you wear a hat. Question the individual. About my appearance, is it because of my hat? Yes. I forgot it at home. You can call my apartment and ask my wife. I will do that very thing. All right, 4258. I mean, she could be conspiring with him as well. Hello, Rafflin speaking. Excuse me, ma'am. Did your husband leave his hat at home? My husband is not at home. I am well aware. His hat? Yes, he left it here. Hmm. Very likely. All right. I'll bite. Go on in. Everything's in order. I'm letting way too many people in. I've let an absurd amount of people in. I know that I'm doing it wrong. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! You have an eyeball on your forehead. So unless you're a psychic, I think we got a big time problem. You also didn't give me anything. Uh, I don't even know if you're on the list or not. Let's just, you know what, let's just question you. Am I not on today's list? I don't even know, I didn't look. I don't know what your name is. There must be a mistake, I should be on the list. Uh, you're horrifying. Look at the list. Don't tell me what to do, lady. Are you just not gonna talk about your appearance? I already answered your question. I have many more questions for you. All right, I don't like your attitude. Guys, get down here, I have an emergency. All right, yada, 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 perfect. Cleaning protocol completed. Oh, hello there. Good afternoon. I don't know if I met you in the last episode. Mia Stone, 5115. All right, Mia Stone, floor three, room one. I know that she didn't give me an entry request, but I'll do that in a minute. Mia Stone, 5115, that checks out. You're a teacher, long hair, small round nose, has freckles, oval face, thin eyebrows. Long hair, small round nose, thin round face, has thin eyebrows. And she has freckles. All right, she's got all, I'm gonna just keep letting these people go. All right, we got the entry request she's missing though. Oh, I'm sorry, I forgot to show you my entry request. I'm a resident from the building, I come from my job as a teacher. I don't have a problem with anybody. I This is so bad, this is so bad. I'm just letting everybody in. There is, there is no security here. I don't even know why they have me here. Apparently, unless you have a zipper or an eyeball on your face, that's an extra eyeball, I'm gonna let you in. Hey, milkman, how's it going? Francis Moses. 1964, all right, all that seems to be in order. Apartment three, room two. I'm a resident from the building. I come from my job as a milkman. All right, the logo looks good. His name is spelled the same. He's not on the list. That's a little suspicious. He says floor three, room two. All right, 8995, milkman. All right, long nose, thin chin, tired eyes, short hair, wears a hat. Long nose, thin chin, tired eyes, wears a hat. Let's call his apartment to make sure he's not there. 4122. If he answers, then I know this can't be him. Francis speaking! Oh my gosh, I'm not expecting any visitors today. Oh my gosh, you're evil! If he answered the phone from his apartment, then you cannot be him. I don't even know. You know what, whatever. Emergency, danger it up. Get the DDD in here. You can continue your job. I might have just killed one of the neighbors, but thank you. Well, hello there. All right, Gloria Schmidt, 1974. We've got the logo there. Gloria Schmidt. Oh no, that is the same. <laughs> I thought that that was different. All right, Schmidt, that's right. Uh, floor two, apartment one, resident of the building, come from my job as a banker. We do certainly have the logo there. Gloria Schmidt. Floor two, room one, with Arnold Schmicht and Gloria. Uh, appearance, round face, mole on the right cheek, short hair, round nose. Round nose, short hair, mole on the right cheek, round face. All right, that checks out. She's a banker. Is that what she said? I believe so. Yep. All right, and her ID number checks out. I'll just call her husband. I like calling people now. I feel like the phone is something I have not utilized until right now, but I feel like it has great value. If her husband's home, he'll be able to vouch for her. Arnold Schmidt speaking. Are you expecting your wife to come home right now? My wife is not at home. All right, that's a good thing. Is she back? She is back. And I think it's really her. All right, you pass. Go on in. Yep, you have a great time. Please don't kill us all. Hey, I don't remember. Were you always wearing glasses? Did you have blue hair? You look weird to me for some reason. All right, Dr. W. Afton, 6214. 
DDD logo expires in 71. All right, we don't have the doctor on the list. All right, I need your entry request. Here's your entry request. Dr. W, I don't think that that's a real name. Afton, oh no. Floor three, room one. I'm a resident of the building. I come from my job as a as a physicist? You're a phys- I thought you were- That's the kind of doctor you are? Oh, he is a physicist. Robust eyebrows. <laughs> Wears glasses, short hair, round nose, square head. All right, square head, round nose, robust eyebrows, and wears glasses. All right, that stuff checks out. All right, let's call Mia, because we know Mia's home, 1425. I bet these people hate me as their security guard. Hello, Dr. W. Afton speaking. My fiance and I are in the apartment right now. Um, We're not expecting any visitors today. Oh my gosh. I don't know what's wrong with you, bro, but there is something big time wrong with you. Three, three, two, one, get down here. Man, apparently calling people is the way to tell what's going on in this place. You can continue your job. Thank you. All right, I feel like I'm on fire right now. Hey, buddy. Hey, buddy. Robertsky Pageman. DDD logo, 12-1973. you look like your photo. Robertsky Peachman. I'm a resident of my building. I come from my job as a shoemaker. We've got the DDD logo down there. Your outfit looks about right. Robertsky is not on my list. He sure isn't. Shoemaker, long neck without eyebrows. <laughs> Big nose has a goatee. All right, that stuff checks out. The ID number, I think, checks out as well. I don't like that I don't have you on the list, buddy, so I'm gonna see if Mr. Albertsky can vouch for you. It's 2668. Hello, Albertsky speaking. Wait, which one am I going after? My brother is not at home. All right, that is good to know. That is good at home. That's good to know. Albertsky is the other one. So, all right, so I think that checks out. All right, we're gonna say he's not on today's list and question him. I'm not on today's list because I had to leave due to an emergency at work. All right. I'll believe you. I don't know how many emergencies in shoemaking there are, but sure. Go on in. I don't care at this point. Are you kidding me? I thought I was doing so well. I captured four doppelgangers. I didn't kill any neighbors. I only allowed one in? I got an A! Isaac had fake documents. Darn you, Isaac. Let me know how you guys think I did in the comments below. And if you guys want to see more of this game in the future, hit that like button and subscribe right now. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.